key to realizing the promise of additive manufacturing is design consolidation, process consolidation. Here is a radical example of both. Pete Zielinski, Additive Manufacturing Media. I'm at the Formnext Expo in Frankfurt, Germany. This rocket engine was made in one piece, in one step. Uh, 3D printed entirely in one piece, no post-processing required, finished out of the 3D printer. So it was made uh, through laser powder bed fusion on a machine from E plus 3D. Four laser machine, four 500 watt lasers, a uh, machine with a build size of 1600 millimeters. This part is 1300 millimeters tall, made of aluminum. It is for a rocket engine that uses liquid oxygen as a propellant. So printing this part took 354 hours at a layer height of 60 micron. Relatively fine layer height because of the resolution required in some of these features. Notably, these internal channels that uh, use the cryogenically cooled propellant as a coolant, circulating it through the housing of the engine. Uh, the design work was consolidated as well. There was not a lot of CAD work that went into this. Leap 71 developed the AI-enabled computational tool that produced this, this model through generative design. So uh, requirements were input in terms of the, the performance needed from the engine, operational constraints were input, and the Leap 71 software arrived at this design through iteration. One of the geometric constraints uh, served additive manufacturing, and it had to do with making sure that every overhang feature was at an angle such that no support structures would be needed, no support structures anywhere. You can see, for example, in the ramp of these internal channels or the way uh, these holes at the bottom, the vertical ones are circular, but the one that's on the side is diamond shaped. All to ensure no support structures, meaning no features had to be removed, meaning no post-processing after this part is 3D printed. We've done other pieces on additive manufacturing for spacecraft and rocket propulsion in particular. Find links in the description.